Police Department in Harrison County, Iowa, has a new tool that will help them take a bite out of crime. An 80-pound German Shepherd. Now they need money to keep him. Reporter Joe Kadat is live with the story. Joe. Logan police tell me it's relatively rare for a town of 1,500 to get a canine unit. The officers there say that the four-legged crime fighter is going to have a tremendous impact on the county and surrounding communities once they get the right funding. Pico, the crime-fighting German Shepherd, will comprise a fourth of Logan's police department if enough donations come in to keep the developing canine unit. It can save lives. Officer Chris Jokums not only has a new partner, but a new companion as the two are housemates. Very close. I mean, me and him are, you know, we're, you know, two peas in a pod. As the number of drug overdoses in Iowa rise statewide, Officer Jokums says Pico is going to be a powerful asset to their now four officer department. Drugs are everywhere. You know, no matter what anybody says or what anybody thinks, I mean, they're, they're in Logan, you know, they're in the small towns. They're, they're going to be around with, with him on duty, him out there. I mean, that gives us an opportunity to take them off the streets. While the town of Logan has regular appearances of a small town, you can leave your door open most of the time. Officer Jokum says Pico is going to be a big asset in helping keep this community safe. It's really important. Um, not only in this town, but in the entire county, because this would be the only dog in the county. So uh, not only can we use it, but we're able to, you know, other departments, other, other towns will be able to use, you know, the, the canine. While I heard mixed reaction from Logan residents about whether or not keeping a canine unit in this town is worth $5,000 in donations, a local restaurant owner says Pico is well worth the community's investment. I think if you can spend $5,000 and you can keep all the drugs off the street, I think you can't put a price on that. And I think if the county can use it and the police department use it, I do think it's worth it. Logan police need to raise the $5,000 within 60 days or they could lose Pico. You can donate by calling the Logan Police Department or the city office number. Both of those numbers are at KMTV.com. Reporting live, Joe Kadat, KMTV Action 3 News. All right, definitely a worthy cause.